Hello guys, welcome to the world travel platform. You will get here great videos about the world. Today's our topic is how much powerful is India in 2022? Let's start our today's topic. We all know that the world facing constant threat from neighboring countries, where the nuclear power decides the authority, with major peacekeeping organizations failing in its duty, the question about how safe is your country and how powerful it is to fight the enemy might strike your mind. The recent Russian-Ukraine crisis is the live example of the fear the world is experiencing for the potential World War III. Let's see that how much powerful is India's military now in the year 2022. Firstly, we need to know the some basic information about the India. Let's begin. India is the seventh largest by area with the second most populous country in the world, also the fastest growing economy in the world. India has a strong potential of being the superpower in the future by having one of the most powerful military strength. It is ranked fourth out of 140 countries with the strength of 1.45 lakh active military manpower. Power index gives it a score of 0.0979. The lower the power index value, the more powerful a nation's potential combat capability is. The country has a powerful allies with the global superpowers such as Russia as well as the US. If we see the missile strength of India, then India has anti-satellite weapon. India is among the few countries in the world which owns anti-satellite missiles including the US, China and Russia. Anti-satellite weapons are space weapons that are designed to disable or destroy satellites for tactical and operational reasons. India has an anti-ballistic missile too. After the United States, Russia, and Israel, India became the fourth country to successfully build an anti-ballistic missile system. ABM stands for Anti-Ballistic Missile, and it is a weapon designed to detect and neutralize ballistic missiles. If we talk about the India's submarine-launched ballistic missile, then India successfully tested fired the K-4 submarine-launched ballistic missile, which has a range of 3,500 kilometers. Only a few countries have managed to achieve this scientific advance. It will provide the country the ability to launch nuclear missiles in Indian waters from a safe distance. Apart from this India has intercontinental ballistic missile like Agni-5 with the range of 5000 to 8000 km, cruise missile Brahmos with each of them having the latest version with more power in development. If I talk about the India's land power, then India's active military personnel is 1.4 million making it the second largest after China owing to its second largest population. The strength of battle tanks in the Indian Army is more than 4,800. India has 2,500 infantry fighting vehicles. India has 3,311 towed artilleries. India has 12,000 armored vehicles. India has 100 self-propelled artilleries and 1,338 rocket projectors. India's defense budget is approximately $71 billion, making it the third largest after the US As we and know that China. India is a nuclear power nation. Currently, India has 150 to 160 active nuclear weapons. India has a nuclear policy of no first use. While the country has never utilized its nuclear weapons, it actually prevents neighboring countries from attacking it. While having the triad capability. Triad capability means nuclear weapons that can be delivered via aircraft, land-based and submarine-launched missiles. Only a few countries, such as the US, Russia, India, and China have this capacity. If I talk about the India's naval strength, then India has total naval fleet of 300. India has 150 auxiliary ships, 13 frigate ships, 10 destroyer ships, 17 submarines, 128 patrol vessels, 22 corvette vessels and 2 aircraft carriers. Now, move forward on the India's air power. The India has more than 2,200 total aircraft. India has more than 560 fighter jets, more than 130 dedicated attack jets, 805 helicopters and 
43 attack helicopters. India has some world's most advanced fighter jets such as, Su-30 MKI, Mirage 2000, Dassault Rafale along with Tejas, MiG and more. From this data, we can easily predict that how much powerful is India now. For more knowledgeable videos like this, please like, share and subscribe our channel World Travel. Thanks for watching.